From the EverQuest Show studios, I'm Fading. Here's a look at what's happening this week in EverQuest. The year of Dark Paw is now underway for both EverQuest and EverQuest 2, and there's a lot of news to round up in this update. So let's start with what you can do in game for the year of Dark Paw. In EQ, your first stop should be the marketplace where you can get your free Orc Metamorph wand, as well as a complimentary bottle of adventure. Then pop over to Blackborough and grab the Year of Dark Paw collections with the special 25th anniversary shinies. Starting next week on January 17th, the anniversary tower will become available, and it has 11 floors that will unlock over over time. The Tower Trial Quest will reward you with special Timeless Tokens currency, which will be used later at the Special Merchant. In EverQuest 2, you should also check the marketplace for your free pet, Max and Bertha Feisty, as well as a free white lacquer bedroom furniture bundle. Now that's good news for those housing decorators out there, and there's even more good news to share if you're looking to spruce up your EQ2 home. Now through January 15th, there's a 20% discount on all houses and housing items from the in-game marketplace. In game, you can start collecting your Dark Paw doubloons from doing the various daily missions from the Year of Dark Paw camp. There are five collections throughout Norath using the Dark Paw shinies and avatars of the gods that you can challenge throughout the year. Two are going to appear at a time, with one arriving at the beginning of each month and another arriving at the end of the month. Also in Year of Dark Paw news, the EverQuest team is going to host an Ask Me Anything, and they're soliciting questions from the community. A post has been made in the EQ forums for your questions, and it's going to be up through February 14th. The question and answers will be gathered and posted for players to read, and this could occur multiple times throughout the year, depending on the volume of questions. The music of the latest expansions for both games is an overlooked but highly enjoyable part of the experience and feel of the newest locations in Norath. Well, now you can enjoy these new tracks from your favorite music streaming services. The music of Laurian Song and Night of Shadows for EverQuest, as well as Renewal of Roe and Ballads of Zamara for EverQuest 2, are now available from Pandora, Spotify, iTunes, and Amazon Music. Altogether, it's nearly 45 minutes of EverQuest music and almost 40 minutes of EQ2 music, all for your listening pleasure. You can add those songs to the original soundtracks for EQ and EQ2 that have also been available for several years now from those same music services. There's also the a cappella EverQuest music performed by the Encore Vocal Ensemble that was released during the 21st anniversary. There are also some in-game events that are happening, including the New Year's Eve events that are still going on in EverQuest through January 21st. And for the raiders out there, Lorien's Song Tier 1 raids opened this past Saturday. For TLP players, some big server unlocks have happened within the past week or so. On January 4th, Eridun and Rizlona unlocked the Reign of Fear expansions, Yelenak unlocked Prophecy of Roe, and the Oakwind server is now experiencing content in the Plains of Power and Legacy of Akesha. And the EverQuest show kicked off the Year of Dark Paw by bringing you the Fippy Awards, our awards for the best of the last year, including the top 10 headlines in EQ, as well as the best new zones and best NPC models for both EQ and EQ2. Make sure you check that out in the latest episode of the EverQuest show. And how would you like to become a part of the EverQuest show? We're here because we love EverQuest. This show is a labor of love, and I enjoy everything that I do with this show, but I also do it almost entirely by myself, and I could use some help. So if you'd like to join me in producing this show, whether it's writing, coming up with story ideas, or maybe even in front of the camera work, I'd love to hear from you. Simply go to everquestshow.com and click on the Help Wanted story. And bonus points if you're in the Midwest, but that's not necessary. And of course, make sure you're subscribed to the EverQuest Show channel so you'll know when the latest episodes drop, as well as getting our weekly updates of This Week in EverQuest with news from the entire franchise. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in NORAD.